let me tell you something. See, you young niggas don't know OG game on here on how to stay alive and stay free. See, I'm going to teach you something, man. You got ops watching you. You got haters watching you. You got cops watching you. You got to be very wise on how you move, man. You can't be out here posting your locations when you still there. You can't be tagging where you at, man. If you still in the location, you can't tag where you at till you're long gone down the street. It ain't their business. Trust what I'm saying. And then when you got people in the building where you at, taking pictures of where you at, and when you there, what you got to do is you can't repost them until about three, four hours later when you done made it to the crib, man. Yeah, because y'all be reposting people and the up watching like, oh, shit, he there not at the dinner table. Or he there at the club. I know where to find them at, so I'm going to sit outside and lurk on him and wait on him and spray him down. You got to stay smart, stay wise. See, in this game, you got to be street smart, book smart, and goddamn have wisdom to see your kids have kids. You can't let these kids trick you off the street because it's a young nigga waiting to meet you at a spot to take from you, kill you, take your life from you. So you got to be wise out here, man. Trouble what I'm saying, dog. So don't post where you at. Don't post locations and don't repost nobody until you done left already. Number two, you can't sit in back alleys and back dark spots, man, and double park cars, man. Yeah, you sitting in this car, man, at a red light and on the block, man. Blocked in, they got your block. You ain't even back then. You blocked in. And guess what? The op come nowhere yet, man. Come knock your head over here. You gotta have a pistol on way ready for a nigga. Cause if he come in your face, you gonna blow him down. You gonna shoot first. Trouble them say so you gotta be on point, dog. Another thing wrong with you niggas, number three. Y'all be wearing these hoodies in the car while you're rolling your weed. Get what the hoodie do? The hoodie blocks your side view. You can't wear no hoodie in the car. See, the hoodie block your peripheral. If I got a hoodie on, I can't see left or right because that hoodie going to blind me to see straight. But the op coming from this side, you got to be careful because the ops, these cops, these haters, and your baby mama looking for your fuck ass because you ain't paid for child support in the last three, four years. You can't wear no hoodie in no car. Take that shit off. Number four, you can't go live in public places. When you at a public place that all the street niggas go to, you can't, you can't go live there. Yeah. You got to be in the crib somewhere. If you know you hot in the street, you got enemies looking for you, got haters looking for you, the police got a warrant for your fuck ass. You can't be going live in no public place. They know where to come get you at because you're live like Channel 5, stupid. You can't do that. Number five. You can't smoke nothing that you ain't roll, and you can't drink nothing that you ain't poke. Man, niggas be pouring shit in the drink before they get to you. Niggas sprinkle a little fentanyl in your weed, dog. Have your pants out, mama crying at your funeral Sunday. You can't smoke that. You ain't roll that. Don't smoke that. See, that's what's wrong with you, nigga. And you women, y'all be out here at the club looking for any nigga to buy you a drink. Nigga done put some goddamn eye drops in your drink, and you wonder why you on his home laid out over his kitchen sink throwing up because he tried to get your fuck ass stuck up. You can't can't do that. Got to be smart. Number six. At the club about to let out. And you know it let out at two o'clock. You got to leave two hours before the club let out. That's like midnight. You got to get up out of there. You can't be walking out when the club and the roaches, the roaches come out, the light come on. Hey, you come walking out. The op waiting outside, waiting on you, fool. He got the chopper. He got the stick. He waiting to blow your ass down. You got to leave two hours before the spot let out. You got to be smart, man, when you out here in these streets, man. Because the off outside, you thinking about fun, how y'all high, how y'all drunk, you ain't on point. The off out there on point with the goddamn beam on your fucking ass ready to hit you. Got to be on point. Trust what I'm saying. Number six, when you out here on these streets and you head to the crib, I don't care if you stay in the suburbs or the hood, you can't take the same exact road that you took last night and the night before that. You can't take that same route home every night. You got to switch it up. You got to hit another corner. You got to make a U-turn and go back. Sometimes you got to pass a high and go back two miles mile down south before you go back and go that way. Trouble what I'm saying? Because it's somebody following your fuck ass right now that you done missed. And he two cars back watching every corner you hit. And just because he ain't hit you, the time that he seen where you parked at, that don't mean he, gonna, he ain't going to get you. Trouble what I'm saying? He watching where you stay at. Number six, you can't never second guess your gut feelings. You can't never second guess your intuition. 
When God give you an intuition that it's a warning, it's a, it's a destruction coming, that's your warning. You got to get out of there. I don't care what tell about you scared. Let me tell you something. A scared man ain't a dead man. You got to be alive. You see these niggas dropping out like fly. These niggas ain't got the OG game out here. These niggas running the street with no kind of wisdom. They dumb. They got the dumb part. They missing the weirds. They ain't weirds dumb. They dumb. Trust what I'm saying. Don't never second guess your intuition of God showing you that the op in there or somebody around us seeing you done shot out a text on you. Man, you can't be around that no more. You got to get up out of there because they following you, fool. Get out of there. Number seven, never underestimate nobody. Oh, he won't do me like that. That be the main one. Do you like that? Oh, she ain't going to do that. She ain't about that life. She the main one trying to set you up for that check. Because you ain't easy to give out the bread like that. But she know you got the bag. So you can't underestimate what they won't do. Because they will. They'll be the first to do it. Have your ass on the goddamn news station in the morning. And I'm just waking up, drinking my coffee. And see your ass laid out on the news. And guess what? It's because you ain't pay attention to these rules. These the rules of the streets. Trust what I'm saying now. And number seven. And seven is God number. Never forget that. Let me tell you something about number seven. Don't you trust nobody. Don't you tell nobody about where your baby mama stay at. Don't you bring nobody to your mama high, your auntie high. Don't bring nobody around there, dog. Because they watching and they remember it and they recall it. And time as y'all fall out, dog, they going to make sure that you pass out. They going to come blow your ass down. Listen, don't trust nobody. When it come to money, when it come to coochie, when it come to jail time, don't trust nobody. When it come to showing people where you keep your money at, don't trust nobody. When it come to any kind of thing with your kids and your immediate family and how you get your money, you can't trust nobody. Because these niggas watch it. These are the rules of the streets. It's only seven rules to stay alive. All you got to do is a plan, and you gonna be out here. I don't care. I know you young niggas watching me, man. But what you gotta understand here? How y'all be smoking weed, smoking smoke that you ain't roll? How y'all be drinking drink that you ain't poke? How y'all be going to the club and trying to knock on the bitch? And guess what? You grind up, knocked up, fucked up, and laid out and stuck up. Cause guess what? Yo, look up. You ain't pay attention to the sign. This OG game out here, man. Stop posting locations. Stop reposting people that tag you because you want to be known. You want the goddamn clout. You want everybody to know where you is. You can't do that. Stop posting up on these back blocks and these red lights and these stop signs thinking you cool like that. Let me tell you something. When you get in money, you become the lick. You used to hit licks. But when you get your money and get your shit together, you become the lick. Trust what I'm saying, man. You got to lay low. You got to stay low key. Get money and stay out the way. It don't matter what they say. It's all about staying alive, dog, and living to tell about it. This shit ain't about going to jail. This shit ain't about being laid up dead, talking about he was a real nigga. This ain't about shooting pistols. The object of having a gun is to never use that motherfucker because you use this gun here. You use wisdom. Trust what I'm saying. Y'all make sure y'all subscribe to my channel, youtube.com slash Brown 305 We the business.